So today I had a buyer who bought 16 of these little magnets all at once. And he wants to put them in a frame and give them to his wife for her birthday. So I just want to see what these might look like all together. And that's a great idea. Every so often somebody comes up with a really nice idea of what to do with these things. And I love seeing them in frames when people uh, buy something and present it and put it in the environment and then they send uh, a photograph back. I love seeing that. So let's see what these look like in a square of four by four. So each piece is 2.75 times 2.75 inches. And they look like this on the back. It's quite thin. And what does that look like? Um, these look great in shadow box frames, I think, would be the best way to present these because you have some depth. You have a, about a 1 16th of an inch thickness in each one of these. And with a shadow box, you've actually got a wall of a certain height. You can specify what height you want that wall to be. Uh, you can have a framer build that for you. It can be any height at all. And so you have clearance and you have your glass in front of that. Normally it's white or off-white. I should actually put this back a little. Okay, let's do that. Uh, so it can be any color, but normally it's uh, the, the surface that you're putting on is foam core, white foam core. And the walls are foam core. Okay, so we're almost there, four by four. Uh, somebody also, this fellow who bought the pieces also had the idea of putting a magnetized board back there without glass. So you could just keep changing these, which is, I think, a great idea. I suppose you'd be bound by the molding the framer could provide, because no, normally there's a slit into which the glass fits in a, in a frame, shadow box frame. Maybe these two are too similar. I'll put this one in there. So, I think that's a great idea. What a lovely gift idea for his wife. So that's 4x4. Four four. Let me push that further back. And how does that look? I think that looks pretty great. That would look wonderful in a frame. You could, of course, do 4x4. Four four. You could do 2x2. Two two. You could get a mat of a certain thickness, too, that exceeds this, just so long as this surface is not riding up on the glass. So that's why I thought a shadow box would be a great way to present these, with or without glass. Okay, let's stop that and see what that looks like.